We interrupt this record to bring you a special bulletin. The reports of a flying saucer hovering over the city have been confirmed. The flying saucers are real. Real well, I feel what my heart can't conceal. That was the Clatters recording. Too real. We switch you now to our on-the-spot reporter downtown. Come on, baby, let's go downtown. Take it away, John Cameron Cameron. Uh, this is John Cameron Cameron downtown. Uh, pardon me, madam, would you tell our audience what would you do if the saucer were to land? Thank you. Another thing, gentlemen, there. What I'm gonna do is hard to tell. Uh, the gentleman with the guitar, what would you do, sir? Take a walk down over the street. Thank you. We return you now. was the Pelican's Outer Space recording Earth. I've just been handed a bulletin. The flying saucer has just landed. We switch you again downtown. Uh, here we are again. We have with us Professor Sir Cedric Fentingmold of the British Institute. And the professor is approaching a saucer to see if there's possibly any sign of life aboard. Well, I'm sure something. Are you there? I hear you now. That was Lapping Lewis's record, Knocking. This is John Cameron Cameron on the spot. And now I believe we're about to hear the words of the first spaceman ever to land on Earth. La, ba, boom, ba, la, ba, boom. And now, here are the ball scores. Four to three, six to two, and eight to one. The impact of seeing the first spaceman has this reporter reeling. Here I go. That was the Clatters again, with their big one, Ha-Oh! This is John Cameron Cameron again downtown. The spaceman has returned to his ship and is taking off. We return you now to our studios. The flying saucer has gone. There is no threat of an invasion. However, the flying saucers are still around. Yeah. 